my name's Murray Mahani, and this week's apple tip is using the noodle in a suspended environment. So this one could be in deep water or shallow because our legs are not stretching down. We're going to do what I classically love calling the butterfly. The Pilates instructors call it the clam, but I call it the butterfly. And some of you that have watched some previous clips recently have used this movement before, you'll know exactly when I came up with it. So you have to look at another YouTube clip. So feet together, legs opening and closing. Now, I'm going to give you a whole sequence of moves now. So, sequence one, legs opening and closing, really slapping your thighs together. Not holding onto the noodle, pushing out to the side and pushing down. So it's one out, one down. One out, one down. One out, one down. Try to keep the arms as straight as you can when you're pushing down between your legs. So it's not, it's more of a that action rather than a that action. But your arms are hanging onto the noodle, so your elbows will bend slightly. So out in, push down, out in, push down, out in, push down. Feet always together. So then, sequence number two. Out in, kick out. Open. So it goes open, close, kick, close. So in, so it's out in, kick. 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 Really cool exercise. No brain training involved in that one. And again, we're not really using the needle much more than just for supporting the body. So, another way you can use it is needle against your lower back. Out in, push down. Out in, push down. Out in, push down. Out in, push down. And then you do exactly the same thing with the legs. Out in, kick. Out in, kick. Out in, kick. Out in, kick. Now notice where the needle's position. It's positioned on my upper back. So it's not up here. The needle comes up here. The hands literally get shorter. So it feels like you're doing nothing. So they've got to push it down as much as they can, grab onto it, grip onto it, so they can keep it in that position while they're doing the exercise. So basically, four variations. Variation one and two, well, the first two exercises are without the noodle. The second two are with the noodle. So you can play around with giving people options or progressively get it higher.